please excuse my appearance. I am obviously momming so hard today, momming out of control. But I wanted to do a video of my glaze results from yesterday's glaze video. And um, I don't know about the rest of you, but if my glaze kiln is done, I cannot wait to look at it. So I cannot wait for my husband to get home to take care of special guest Oliver here today. So he is going to unload the kiln with us. All right. So here is the first piece. I like that. This is um, the Aqua Celadon with a buff textured glaze on top. Um, all these glazes are Amico glazes. Oh, this looks pretty good. This is a pour over. Um, Fog Celadon with Obsidian Celadon dripped over top. This looks nice. This is um, the Lavender Celadon, Obsidian Celadon Dripped. Aqua Celadon um, with just some black underglaze inlay. Really turn out like I wanted it to. Um, this is the Iron Celadon with Arctic Blue over top. Usually the Arctic Blue over the Iron comes out like this, pretty blue and nice, but I guess it just wasn't a heavy enough application, so to try that again. Here is a galaxy mug, looking pretty good. Love these. Oh, this looks good. This is a special order, so I won't show it too close, but maybe just a little bit. This is the Lavender Celadon again with just some um, black velvet underglaze. Oh, I was really curious about this. So I just got the wasabi celadon in and I hadn't tried it yet. Um, but it looks pretty good. So wasabi celadon is a winner. Another galaxy mug. Oh, this looks really nice. Look at that. Juicy. What are you doing, Oliver? Okay. Beauty and the Beast teapot looks great, looks good. Those are celadons, also. And that's it. So I hope you enjoyed my results. Um, like I said, the, these were the results from the video that I uploaded earlier called Let's Talk About Glaze. So thanks for watching. Say bye-bye. Say bye-bye.